In this video, I will show you how to make palace style yuja cha, a traditional Korean tea made from a citrus fruit called yuja in Korean and yuzu in English and Japanese. The yuja fruit originated in China. It spread to Korea and also to Japan more than a thousand years ago. Yuja is one of the most cold tolerant citrus varieties, making it possible to farm it on the Korean peninsula. Yuja cha was greatly enjoyed by the royalty in Korea. King Sejong, the most famous of Korean kings, drank yuja cha. The only two ingredients in palace style yuja cha are yuja fruit and honey. To begin, I heat up the honey a bit to make it easier to work with. The next step is to cut the washed yuja fruit into quarters and slice it very thin. I add a layer of sliced yuja to a glass jar. Then I add some honey. I alternate layers of yuja and honey until the jar is full. Traditionally, the entire fruit, including the rind and the seeds, is used, but you can discard the seeds if you prefer. The yuja rind is an essential part of yuja cha. It has an intense aroma and flavor unlike any other citrus fruit that I have tried. The yuja fruit is sour on its own and is balanced by the sweetness of the honey. Yuja cha is still very popular in Korea. Because honey is expensive, commercial products typically use sugar, even the ones including honey. I like the commercial products, but homemade yuja cha is far superior. I keep homemade yuja cha fresh until drinking by refrigerating it. When it is time to drink it, add 2 or 3 teaspoons of yuja cha to a cup and add hot water. Seeds can be discarded at this point. Yuja cha is a great hot drink to enjoy in the winter time. It is high in vitamin C and is often used in fighting a cold. It is also a popular hangover remedy. After drinking the tea, you can eat the peel. It's delicious. My family and I love yuja cha, but it's not for everyone. If you'd like to try yuja cha before going to the trouble of making your own, there are many commercial products that can be found in Korean grocery stores. Although the yuja is not a citron fruit, the products are often called Korean honey citron tea. If you would like to order yuja cha online, I have a link in the description below where you can buy it. If you would like to grow your own fruit, trees can be bought in the United States and Australia from reputable disease-free sources. I hope that you have enjoyed this video. If you liked it, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the YouTube channel. In Japan, the yuzu fruit is used in a bath on the winter solstice. My family tried it and we all liked having the fruit in the bath. If you have an idea for a citrus-related video that you would like me to make, please suggest it below in the comments. Thank you.